would say what it means to be a UNLV athlete. I think it would be our work ethic, our ability to accept other people. I'd say that our team is very diverse and we have a, a lot of like different personalities. Just having good work ethic and the ability to inspire other people. From a junior college in California, Antoinette Rolda had to adjust to the bright lights of Las Vegas in the competition at a D1 school. Coming in, I didn't know a lot of things because of the level that I was playing at beforehand. I mean, playing at a D2, it's not as strict. I had to learn a lot coming in, um, whether that was in the weight room or in the gym or even time management. We do have study hall hours and we take school very seriously besides volleyball. But other than that, yeah, there's a lot of aspects that I had to learn when I came. For Rolda, there's a deeper meaning to the sport. Volleyball is more than just the game. It's it's really reaching out to the community and just building that relationship with other people. Like these girls really look up to us as um, as their role models. And I think one thing that my coach emphasizes is just have the ability to build relationships outside of our own team. After playing for eight years, Rolda is stepping off the court and dedicating her time to other players with the same dream. Now that I'm done with volleyball, um, I'm actually not thinking of playing anymore. I think I'm done, yeah. But I am gonna coach a team out here next spring, so I'm excited. It's another way to stay in touch with volleyball. This club team that I'm gonna coach in the springtime, they're called Vegas United. What I can bring to them is just knowledge that I've gained through my coaches here and my experiences here, so we'll see how it goes. Other than being a rebel on the court, Rolda is taking her leadership skills into the healthcare administration field. My parents were already in healthcare. Just seeing how like my parents were able to make an impact in helping people. I mean, I would say that I am very similar in that way and I've always wanted to help people. I wasn't really sure how I wanted to do that growing up, but as I got older, it just kind of stuck out. Like healthcare administration was just like, something that really like stuck out to me. I think this community is very strong and I think there's a lot of room for growth and especially in the healthcare field, there's a lot of opportunities, especially for what I want to do. The City of Lights is Rolda's new home. I want to stay in Las Vegas just because when I moved here, I just had like a sense of independence and I think that I didn't get to experience that as much when I was at home. That also like helped me like fall in love with the city. I just think that being on my own and figuring things out out here is really gonna help me succeed. After playing two years for UNLV, Rolda is leaving with the Forever Rebel family. I would say one thing that I'm going to miss is simply just coming to the locker room and seeing all the girls. I mean, I, it sounds very simple and like cheesy, but We've grown to be a family, and I think that seeing everyone every day, I mean, that has just become a routine ever since I got here, and I think that the amount of support that we have for each other is just tremendous, and I think that that's definitely one thing I'm gonna miss, is just seeing everyone's faces every day, so.